welcome 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 uh, Aquarians this is your business reading sorry for the lateness of this business reading uh, sorry for the lateness alrighty let's see what is happening and transpiring so wow Aquarians what a uh, danger Aquarians 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 so Aquarians this month of uh, this these are timeless reading if you'd like to see the extended of this reading please use the link um, to join and you will receive the extended okay so Aquarians it is a clear cut message a lot of you Aquarians were stealing um, with a um, a fire sign person, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarian, and I see heartbreaks for this person and failure for this person. So a lot of you, whatever that was happening and transpiring, you were having issues dealing with a um, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person. So some sort of information is coming in this month, and it's coming from the night of. Uh, Pentacles, and this person is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Now, whatever is happening to this person, you can see that this person could have found out some sort of information about this person. So, this could be a boss, this could be someone that is going to be telling you, Aquarian, something about this um, fire sign person and what they did and who they are. So whatever is happening in transparent, expect um, Aquarians to receive some sort of a message um, from this person. Whether this person is in whatever is transparent, you are going to be receiving some sort of a message. So I see interference and interference is coming in from uh, uh, interference is coming in from a fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is and whatever this fire sign person have done, I see um, heartbreaks is coming up for this person. Um, not only this fire sign person, but uh, for this uh, um, man. So you're dealing with an earth sign person. You're dealing with a fire sign person. I see regrets, a whole lot of regrets that is happening and transpiring. Um, then we see the energy of interference, and this is a past life issue, situation, heartbreaks, and failure. So whoever this person is and whatever is going on, I see that this person is, uh, cre has created some sort of an issue, some sort of a problem um, for a lot of you Aquarians. Um, now, it could be a situation where some of you are investigating this person. Whatever this Knight of, of, of Pentacles is, uh, some sort of an info interference has come in. And this Knight of Pentacles is realizing the disturbance of some sort of a um, situation that was transpired. And I see heartbreak for this Knight of Pentacles. Um, some of you, this is your boss. Some of you, this could be someone on the work floor. Whoever this person is... Uh, has created some sort of a problem in the past and in the future this person is being heartbroken over what has happened and transpired and has failed uh, fail miserable uh, because uh, what we're seeing here for you Aquarian at the bottom and your foundation is that you Aquarian are going to be receiving some sort of a luxe and abundancy because they have realized uh, some sort of a destructiveness uh, that these two people could have created. So whoever this knight is, is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person. And uh, this could be a boss or just someone on the work floor created some sort of an issue via either an email that they wrote or something, but they had interfered in a situation and now it is backfiring on this person. The Wheel of Fortune is here and you realize uh, that... Uh, it is a karmatic situation. So a lot of you are dealing with a lot of people in the work floor, especially the fire sign and the night and, and the disc of uh, pentacles. And this disc of pentacles uh, is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn man. It is a man. 
And what is transpiring is that this man, together with a, um, uh, a fire sign person, have created some sort of a destructiveness. And the truth is now out. So whatever the interference is, it, it was caused by this knight. Whoever this knight is, um, whoever this disc is, it was caused by this person. So let's look and see. So the Wheel of Fortune is in is here and the Wheel of Fortune is sitting in a very strong position for you Aquarians. So you Aquarians, there could be a lot of fortunate situation that is going to be coming up for you um, because, you, you know, now they are realizing and seeing exactly what is transpiring. But when we look at your stability, your stability is four. Anything that has to do with four is a very good stability because what is happening and what is transpiring is that they're realizing that whatever this person has created, together with this fire sign person, the influence that they created, you still stand strong. And this is good. This is what you need to take out of uh, this month um, or this timeline whenever you pick up this reading because this reading is a timeless reading. Three and seven is here. Um, twice four is here. Eight is here. The infinity, that means uh, these were karmatic problems, karmatic issues, uh, a situation that was transparent. And whoever this person is, uh, this person is someone that has been affecting you and your life for quite some time. Now there is heartbreak for this person because uh, what is transparent is that this person had influenced a situation and now there is heartbreak for this person because people are now realizing the um, dishonesty of this fire sign person and what this fire sign person have done to some of you on the work floor. So um, this fire sign person, what is here is sorrows for this fire sign person because now they're realizing that this fire sign person had created a whole lot of issue and a whole lot of problem with a project, with a business, um, and especially for a project that some of you were working on. This fire sign person has created some sort of a problem and some sort of an issue. And now they're picking this up and showing you. So when we look at the first week, the first week uh, um, is the energy of the Eight of Swords. Now the Eight of Swords is about finding out the truth about some sort of a... Um, um, maybe it was a, um, chaos that was created around you in your life, in your business. And they're now realizing this chaos that has happened and transpired. And it's trying to resolve the situation in the first week because they realize that uh, um, whoever this um, disc is, because the disc is someone between the age of 18 and 45, had created some sort of a huge issues and problem and situation. And now what is coming up and transpiring is that um, they are realizing how um, this person uh, created some problems that created issues um, with workflow efficiency, um, problems with uh, um, communication. This person could have communicated some sort of a bad thing or this person with communication created some sort of a problem. Now, in the second week, the Wheel of Fortune is here and this is standing strong. So you Aquarians is really standing strong in the second week because it's as if you're taken back and there you are standing very strong and you have a sort of a protection around you because um, this, this wheel brings uh, protection and it is showing up uh, protection and you're standing where you're protected um, from a situation and um, people are really realizing the effect of, of what this person has done. So um, this is a month that you need to stand strong no matter what is transpiring. The wind that is blowing from two sides of you, you need to stand strong because you need to understand that you have the powers uh, um, that no one else around you have, uh, especially um, with this project, this work, this business. Uh, you have the power that no one else around you have. And that is going to be uh, generating and pushing you 
in a positive alignment moving forward. So you have the energy of the Wheel of Fortune, and this is a very lucky, a lucky energy. So in the two, second week, if you're looking for a job, hoping for uh, some sort of a new start, it is going to be happening. It is a month. Whatever changes you decide to make is a yes. Go ahead. As we look at the third week, I see heartbreaks is coming up for this fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Um, there is a lot of doubt, sorrows, uh, heartbreaks, uh, um, not being clear. People are realizing that and they're now realizing the, um, that this person has not been very honest. So I see a whole lot of sorrows uh, for this fire sign person because they're realizing this fire sign person has not been very honest and clear about certain situation. And they're now picking up on that uh, and realizing how this person has abused the system, the company, um, the, the company information and that sort of a thing. And they're holding on and not uh, uh, um, giving this fire sign person any lead way in anything because they realize that this person came in and abused a company, abused a situation. And now they're realizing what this person has created. So I see um, a project uh, um, for this fire sign person is going to be blowing up. It's as if this project, uh, um, this is the seven of disc, uh, and uh, this seven of this, whatever this um, person was creating and trying to um, create around you is falling apart. So it's as if this person had to uh, create some sort of a problems issue around you. And it's, it's, it's as if it's blowing up in smoke. So I see this person is still trying to work on something. It's like some people don't get it and some people don't understand it. Uh, that uh, they need to let go of something because they re they're not re realizing how um, a situation is not looking good. But yet still they're trying to reconstruct something. And I see you Aquarian is standing back. Uh, Standing in your powers and really recognize uh, that this person is out of balance. Uh, and I think that this, that is going to be good for you Aquarians because you're really realizing how out of balance this person is. And you are going to be trying to regain your form of stability and clear up uh, some sort of an issue that these two people had created. So Aquarian, this is um, absolutely a wonderful uh, month. The Wheel of Fortune, the Four of Cups is standing strong. Whoever this Aries Leo or Sagittarian person is uh, that was creating problems and issues around you is going to be resonated out of your life because it's as if the universe is coming in and said, listen, you have created enough damage and um, you need to um, leave uh, you know, this, this Aquarian, because um, this Aquarian is on the right part in their life and is moving forward in a very positive way. And you need to resolve the situation and let this Aquarian go. So I see Aquarian, it is uh, um, no matter who comes at you and wh who what they're trying to create around you, you are going to be a very... Um, very smart getting out of this problem and this issue that these people had created because uh, um, it's as if uh, managers, uh, higher ops is going to be coming in and is going to be realizing that this fireside person is not where they should have been, okay? And because of that, they're going to be resolving the issue by removing this person from their position or removing this person totally out of the company um, because of some sort of a on dishonesty that this person have created with a, a manager or a supervisor in the past, and now truths is coming up. So, um, Aquarians, um, this reading has all extended reading, extended part. So please uh, um, use the link. Join, join the channel in order to receive the extra um, readings. This reading is going to go further. Please remember to thumbs up, uh, um, subscribe, turn your notification button on, 
and I will see you on the other side. If not, I am saying namaste until next time. These readings are timeless, so if you have any question that is coming up, you can use them to find out what is going on. I love you guys. Namaste.